Welcome everyone. So we will be dis discussing Indian Contribution to Science. This is a book which is compiled by Vikyan Bharati and this is one of the chapters which is there for the VBM examination. Chapter 17, Discovery of Gravitational Waves, the Indian Contribution. One of the landmark discoveries of the 20th and the 21st century so far in the discovery of gravitational waves, GW, the existence of gravitational waves was predicted exactly 100 years ago by Albert Einstein based on his general theory of relativity. It is interesting to know that he did not believe that the gravitational waves will be discovered in the laboratory. Why? It is because the amplitude of gravitational wave will be so small. Let's stand to minus 21 meters that no experiments will be able to measure this small displacement corresponding to about one millionth of the diameter of the proton. The beauty of the theory made the experimentalists design appropriate experiments to detect such a small displacement. For the last 25 years, about 1000 scientists from more than 25 countries are actively involved in this task. In this team, there are 37 Indian scientists working in various academic and research institutions in India. On 14 September 2015, scientists were able to detect the arrival of gravitational waves that originated about 1.3 billion years ago. They were able to observe gravitational waves using the facilities at two laser interferometer gravitational observatories, that is LIGO, in the U.S. They got the wave pattern exactly as predicted by Albert Einstein using his general theory of relativity. Einstein showed that the space-time surrounding a massive object is curved and any particle moving in the vicinity of the object will trace a curved path instead of a straight line. The curved path taken by the particle will be appearing as though it is being attracted by a force from a massive object. This generates what is called gravitational field. The curvature of the space surrounding the massive object will depend on the mass of the object. Any significant event in the universe will generate disturbances in the gravitational field and will produce gravitational waves. There are 37 Indian scientists from Isaac Ramanandapuram and Kolkata IIT Ahmedabad, TIFR Indian Institute of Mathematical Sciences, Chennai Inter University Cons Consortium for Astronomy and Astrophysics, which is IUCA, Pune, Raman Research Institute, Bangalore, and Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore, who were active participants in the global initiative of LIGO experiment. These machines that gave scientists their first ever glimpse of gravitational wave are the most advanced detectors ever built for sensing tiny vibrations in the universe. The two US-based underground detectors are known as Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory or LIGO for short. India is aiming to get world's third LIGO at an estimated cost of 1,000 crore. As a part of the ongoing Indo-US cooperations in science and technology, America will provide India with nearly 140 million worth of equipment. Professor C. S. Unikrishnan from TIFR is the leader of Indian LIGO experiment. He is one of the 137 authors of research paper published in the Physical Review Letters in February 2016. It is hoped that Indian LIGO will be functional within a couple of years. The gravitational wave opened up another window for astronomy. The observatory will be operated jointly by the Indy LIGO and LIGO and would form a single network along with the LIGO detectors in USA and Virgo in Italy. The design of detector will be identical to that of the advanced LIGO detectors in the USA. Thank you.